Well, welcome back guys. Last time we did some stuff that I pretty much do not remember because it's been a while. I usually record these in bulks. But um off the top of my head without looking at my notes. Um Okay, I'm getting them their names wrong. I think it's Jinsu Jinsu Yun and Namso Yu, right? Jinsu Yu. God, I, I just mixed them up. I, what was, I'm so dumb. I can't remember both their names. Why do, you, why did they make their names so similar? Jin So Yu, Jin So Yun, Jin So Yun. It's the bad one. I mean, they're both equally. Well, one's more badder than the other. The other one's just a snake. I'm not calling her the B word yet until she does some extremely shit. Well, on the other hand, she did get the village attack. I mean, does does she deserve the B word yet? Maybe we should just call her biscuits. Well, anyways, Jin So Yun uh, needs to kill the four guardians. Sorry, I I keep mixing up their names. I'm like, okay, is this the right one? Is this not the right one? So. Maybe I should just call her Nam Jinso and Namsu. Namso. Well, whatever. One of these days I'll get their names right. But yeah, she needs to kill the four guardians. We found out she well, we know that she killed Master Hung. And that the other two are presumably dead because they said they were gone dead. The only one we didn't get confirmation on was um Mushin, who's refusing to let uh fortune teller star seeker guy find his whereabouts. But we did find out a way to find him through the Mushin compass created by the first Mushin leader guy. So we need, so we need to get the compass back who um, the cult leader had, but he got force choked by Jinso. So we got to get that compass back to find the current heir of the Mushin. Because uh, he's the, he or she is the final one they need to kill. For her, her master to come out or something. But yeah, but then we would teleport to this village. Well, we ran to this village to find a doctor that can help us with the black ro the rose black, the black rose mark, I believe. And uh, dur during that, we met some operative. Uh, operative. I've got her name. It's not, um, it's not Beimu. Beimu was the exorcist lady that the general do. I think he might have liked her or loved her. But yeah, she ended up dying. And he's currently moping around in the dumps after his love died. But yeah, we're here. Uh, so we found out that we're a vessel for... Something or well, we can be a vessel for something because we have the black mark the black rose mark and Came here we found out Lu Sung's terrible tragic Well, it's a tragedy backstory About his entire family and his sister in a way They kind of make me hate him a little bit less kind of pitying him now if if he does do anything I hope he kissed to kill the one guy that we're about to go after but yeah he made an example of the village by hanging or posing the dead bodies of his parents in the village so people are mad because people are mad because uh, the family didn't follow the order or whatever they didn't comply comply with the head dude, whose name I can't remember off the top of my head. Because if because if he had asked them, you know, they would have done it. But yeah, they're blaming them for that. Um, but yeah, a nice girl asked us to move the body, which we did. And then the village earned the wrath of the what's his name again. So they jumped the girl. And I'm upset that I didn't get to beat them up. 
but the doctor came in, stopped him from beating her ass. And then we went for a moment. We got tainted by the dark side. And then I'm not mad about it. We got to kick their ass and some other people who, I don't know, might have more or less deserved it. So I'm not really upset about it. They had it coming. But yeah, so now he told us we got to relax, chill. We have to let go of our anger of Lu Sung. But I don't know. If I get a choice, I might choose the dark side. Not gonna lie. Because I really do want to kill him, but I... But I still want him to do what he has to do and kill that guy. Okay, now let's read the notes. Mm. Po Dun is a vagrant bound secret master? Question mark. Dope Dun, self proclaimed best healer in the Four Continent. Oh, I also kind of like Old Man Cho next to Hajun, because he's kind of like a Sundere. In a way, he's kind of tough on us, but he kind of. Eh, you know, I'm not sure. I'm not really saying the word like or love, but he's trying to help us in a way because while he's doing that, he's also teaching us these new skills. Uh, Lu Sung's sister forced to marry. Yeah, we went over that. We were wavering between light and dark. Yo, I remember I wrote his name down. Gwen Gwen Han, the tire, Tyrian high cleric, force choked it to death. Hunter on. Oh, it's the dude who's the press. Fatso minions releasing dark. Oh yeah, the Fatso minion of Jinsu Yun is releasing dark chi in the underground and is making zombies or corrupting people. So we gotta do something about that eventually, unless they're done because we did. Confronted them. Bro, I can't believe I wrote the... Oh, I did write it down. It's like at the very top on episode... Is that an 8 or a 6? Episode 18. Uh, Colono? Yokai? Yeah, because he was part of the... Um, was part of the royal house or something where he was a um, advisor. No. A council member or something. But then... Uh, he got caught with corruption, so he dipped. Or was it the other guy? Bro, my note-taking skills are terrible. But yeah, so they asked us to go apology, apologize to General Yokai. So we're on the way. Jinbin, are you leaving, Master? I can't come with you. Mir Young needs somebody to protect her from the villagers. I know you're disappointed, Master, but I promise I'll train every day. You know what? I might as well accept that you are my di disciple. You better do a good job protecting her. I'll come find you when I can. Will you? You know, now that I think about it, did they take off his band aid bandages? Didn't he have some on his head? If this guy does come back in the future, I hope he becomes a badass. Alright, self-proclaimed healer, my disciple. Alright, so who are we looking for? Oh, dude, you better not make me climb up there again. Oh, okay. That's Yonkai? Are you serious? You know, when they mentioned Young Kai, I was expecting a bigger dude, like extremely buff. I did not expect Young Kai to beat this. I forgot. You remember that guy's name from Shrek or Shrek 1 2, the prince or the king? He reminds me of him. Well, in his image or appearance. But man, I was expecting someone extremely bigger and threatening. Not a small smurf, but whatever. I know you. You're the sniveling waste of life who's been poking around, killing my men, getting in my way, and generally pissing me off. Can't we just kill him? Haha, <laughs> you've done me quite the favor. They were fools, and you showed them the price of weakness. But even still, you did kill soldiers loyal to me. That means you owe me a penance. 
I'm surrounded by incompetence. They lost the Nemo Shanty or Marmo Symphony or whatever it's called. That means they lost Mushin's legacy. But you are going to fix their mistakes and bring the legacy to me. Um... Turn my fan off. I can hear their still hear their screams. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I can't. I don't know. Like if reading it from the outside, that's really a terrible thing. But maybe he could secretly be a good guy. Like he did it to protect the village or something. No, no, that's impossible. He forced Lu Sun's sister to marry him. So no, he's a terrible. That's probably. He's probably happy about it. Lucian's legacy is the raw power of the Divine Fist. I would explain further, but it'd probably go over your simpleton head. All you need to know is that I want it. No Lucian, one of the four guardians who stopped the Dark Lord's forces in the Cinderlands. His martial skills were unmatched, hence the name Mushin, the Divine Fist. Yo, that's pretty badass. I'm so glad this game has cinematic cutscenes. Is there any reason all these demon fiends are all females? Jesus Christ, did he just bicycle kick at her? Wow. But did you really have to go that hard on all these mi minions, peon? Divine Fist Mushin. I want Mushin's legacy. I don't care if you have to smash every pot, torch every village, or call down the wrath of the Dark Lord himself to do it. But you will bring me Mushin's legacy. Question. But as I'm aware, isn't that the past Mushin? Because it's a title, I'm assuming, that's passed down from their family or household. Because it did say the compass will point to the current Mushin hair. So it's it's a technique passed down their household. So there's that wasn't exactly him, but it's currently someone else. Alright, so why? Because I'm Colonel Yonkai, and because I told you to. And if you don't, I will set fire to every man, woman, and child in Sandstone Village. Now go, speak to Jong Rishu and find the legacy before I lose my patience. I don't see why we just can't kill them and kill everyone here. Yes, I always resort to violence first. That's my first option, if it's possible. But then again, it could be like, oh, he's only the small leader or something. Or once he's dead, the, the, there will be a void and all the drug lords or someone will try to fill it and take it over or something. Don't keep me waiting. Hey, I'm on 30. Also, I did the soul boost thing again. It handed me all this trash. I'm calling it trash because I have no idea what to do with it. I kind of wish they just gave me money so I expand my inventory because I need 24 silver or whatever. Platinum. Oh, it is silver. Okay. Chung Richu. You're already well working for the Colono. Corno. Colono? Right? No, Colonel I don't know. Yonkai seems to have taken a liking Colin to you no. in his Colin no. peculiar way. Don't it's expect the same kindness from me. Kindness? My ass. You want to work for the Colonel? Fine. Colonel. Our supplies are running low and the Colonel likes the meat. Of it's the bothering me that I can't pronounce this word. Colin no. That doesn't sound right correct. That doesn't sound right either. Our supplies are running low, and the Corno lacks the meat of the Blackbird in this region. Who does this runt think they are? Trying to win favor with the Colono? Gather Blackbird ribs and bring them to our cook. If you manage to not bungle that, I may give you actual work. Excuse me? Why are you staring at me? See something you like? Go get those ribs. Uh, I want to kick him in the balls. This ass. I'm keeping an eye on you. Mm. Oh yeah, I'm playing a female character. I forgot. 
I mean, he could be gay. I mean, he could swing but both ways. I don't know why, I thought I was playing a male, because I always play males. Dusty Nullhorn? Oh man, that, that, that attack looks really cool. Do I, oh, I need five. Okay. Mm, there's not a lot of them. It's a floating rock. Was it gravity dust or something? Oh, I'm planning on separating the series in two parts. Because I didn't think it'd be this long. So I'll probably do it like how I did Vindictus. Like separated by season 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So I'll, each part, might, I might include like three chapters. So this one will be the prologue, chapter 1 and 2. I check how many quests are in chapter 2, but I didn't read anything about it. Or the description, but Jesus, Chapter 2 has a lot of quests. When they told me this will take three days, I think they meant it's for people who knew the game or knows how to play the game and know what they're doing and not reading or watching dialogues and cutscenes. But I'm here for the story. Oh no, I gotta give it to you. Or not. Oh, it's this guy. What do I make for the colono? What in the? Why are you bringing me blackbird ribs? There's hardly any meat here. I'm following Jong Richu's order. Okay, I see what's going on. Jong is having some fun with you. He did the same to me a few times when I first signed on with Colonel Yonkai. He's, he's a bastard, frankly. <laughs> you seem like a decent sort, so take my advice. Run, run as far from the Colonel as you can before he takes what you love most and destroys it right in front of you. I think he can promise you it's worth your soul. So what did he take from you? And at that point, why are you still following him? You have nothing to lose. I will have just foot him up. But the reason I said foot for anyone that wants to know is because I, I got this Reddit feed a while back and it said, oh, what words people use instead of cursing. I was like, oh, cool. That was a fun read. Uh, Keep that between you and I, yeah? Get back to reach you before he starts getting suspicious. Good luck. Okay. Ominous good luck. Yeah. I saw you taking your time with the chef. I would suggest you not waste your time. Oh, shut up. Bento, I'm going to make sure that you pay for your insolence. I have new orders for you, straight from the colonel. Find Soha at the Raider's Ark and help her locate the Naryu Sarasva. Who is Soha? She's a treasure hunter. The Colonel hired her after she disposed of a group of Jewel's private army, the Yes Men. He liked what he saw. We could fund an entire battalion with what we're paying her. Go to Raider's Ark and find Soha. Or else. Or else what? Oh, yeah. They're threatening the village. Do not disappoint me. Oh, level 31. Already? Wow. Bro, this game really needs some mount. I didn't ask where this stuff came from because I don't want to know. Got it? Opal. Hey, I'm trying to get a look at Soha. Would you mind moving over a bit? Oh, she's cute. Soha, where? You don't know Soha? Have you been sleeping under a dune? Soha's the greatest treasure hunter and gunslinger ever. Uh, I'm not sure about the tone, though, or the... Is that the dialect, right? She's strong. Don't take no for an answer and gets things done. Oh, another cinematic cutscene. Okay, let's see how bad she is. Bro, dude, why do you have so much... What's with that armor? Oh. Boobies. 
can really clip those nails. Yo, why is this guy hobbling? <laughs> is he supposed to be like a crab or a sea urchin or something? Is that why the armor is like that? Bullseye. Oh, they didn't drop her She's name. Awesome. I want to be just like her when I grow up. Well, maybe without the drinking. Because usually when they do this like cinematic intro, they can drop their names like um with Mushin. Uh, okay. Hmm. Is this her traveling band of treasure hunter? Oh, she's cute too. Look, friend, I don't have time to mess around with wide eyed fans. I've got work to do. Oh man, I hope I can get a sniper rifle like that eventually. Yokai sent me to check up on you. Doesn't trust me, huh? Fine, I'll put you to work. Zhang Rishu's got me shooting anyone who's carrying anything suspicious. Like that yes man whose brains I just liberated. I wonder what he was carrying. Head out there and bring that package back. It may have the Naryu Sarasva in it, or at least something worthwhile. I don't like to waste bullets. And don't even think about running away with whatever he had. I have enough bullet in this chamber. I've got you in my crosshairs, warrior. Bro, really, man? Dressed up like a crab or whatever? Is that why he was like lowering, crouching down, like he was some kind of urchin or something, or lobster? So it's a weird armor design to go with, though. Faster sprinting wind or mounts. Yonkai has better taste in recruits than I thought. What was in the package? Here, have a look. Hmm, this letter was meant for Boss Jewel of the Yes Men. It says the Naryu Sarasva is now in two parts. The scavengers have both, but they're fighting over them. Well, June Wall, it looks like we'll be seeing each other again very soon. The jackals have one half and the vultures have the other. So here's the plan. I'll go to the jackals dig and you go to the vultures dig. You find one piece, I'll find the other. Dealing with the jackals won't take me long. I'm gonna scrounge up any ammo I can find and restock. Head out first. I'll catch up. Shame, I have to waste ammo on those second-rate treasure hunters. Okie dokie. Uh, it's this way. Okay, just checking if I could teleport. Oh hey, it's that young white girl that we rescued from the cold. Woohoo, we got it. Um, she probably has it. Because uh, I believe she was looking for a relic or something, right? Her and her dad. I'm quoting my fingers. What was that skill? Fill it up, you get go. Look, press Zerk. Burst out mode. Man, I gotta get used to this E for clicking. For dodging. I'm so used to clicking space bar to dodge. Uh, do I have rain on this? 
No, it's the pull. Boss Hang Bong, the Jackals, and the Vultures. I guess I'm killing both of you. Oh, is it like one one cave that connects from like it's two entrances and this is the center. So the vultures have one half and the jackals have one half. And they share this cave. Is that's how um uh Soha came and meet us here? I mean that seems like a terrible hideout. Wouldn't you just want a cave hideout to yourself or something? In case if you ever get backstabbed, I mean, they are bandits. There's no honor among thieves. Lotus Palos, you know what's here, but this was a two-person job. Gil, her henchman, uncle, whatever, must have helped. Yeah, so... It, they say the jackals and vultures against each other, and then confusion took both halves of the... Was she talking this entire time? You what? Clever. I'll give her that. Let's go. We need to. We need a plan. Okay. Mm. She's taken. Yeah, I kind of saw that coming. So her dad helped it her. So they plan to get the two against each other. Yeah, both tunnels, same place. Okay. Pretty much what I was uh, spectating, not spectating, expecting, assuming. Well, you you smart people know why I meant. All right, so huh? What we're gonna do about you uh, or Young Wa? Your technique is unmistakable. You're you're with the Hong Moon School, aren't you? What are you doing here? Oh, how she know? Man, but why is she so glossy? I mean, she. He does look pretty attractive, I'm not gonna lie. Mm. Yep. Uh, is she part of the Hong Moon School too? Sorry to, uh, to have to tell you. The school was destroyed? And Master Hong with it? I... I can't believe it. You're the last student of Master Hong? How did you know him? Master Hong was a great man. I'm still alive because of him. Now I work for that scum Yonkai. The master probably wouldn't be too proud. Master Hong, I never got a chance to thank I you. I have my own reasons for working with Yonkai. But what about you? Yonkai's crazy. Why are you caught up with him? Yonkai would destroy Sandstone re Refuge if I don't help him. That sand-sucking bastard. I knew he was crazy, but not like this. Warrior, let me help you. I owe it to Master Hong, and I'd love to watch that hog Yonkai squeal. What? I knew he was crazy, but not like this. Do we know the same person? The same person who forced a young girl to marry him. And then she killed in herself. And then he went to kill the family and posed them to show as an example for the entire village to see. Do you not know him? He's exactly the same guy. That's as crazy as you're, you're going to get. The only thing that will get crazier than this is if he ate the body. And was a cannibal too. Clearly. She does not know the same person I do, or have heard rumors about. If we want the Naryu Sarasva, we've got to find Yanwa and Gil. I'll go to the Mirage and ask around. Word is Gil's been spotted at Crescent Spring. Go talk to him. Wanna know more about wind walking? Read the letter already. Bro, Master Cho, can you just teach me how to sprint faster, please? Instead of wind walking, I barely even... I mean, I use it from time to time, but it's not as much as sprinting. Or give me a mount. Oh, what is this? What did I just do? I just click Q. Um. Oh, what's what is this? Connect to a skystone within 20 meters. Resist damage and status effect when connected with skystone. 
Oh, is this how I do some of the airborne skills? Oh, cool. Oh, <laughs> sweet. So this is how I get airborne. I thought, I thought they were gonna teach me double jump or something. That's sweet. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah. First mission, Dragon Blood. All right. Heads up, little warrior. Time to stop being a lazy bum and start doing some actual work for once. I need Dragon Bone inscription. The world is a funny place. Dragon bones are sort of valuable. So the trade union thingy is giving some away as prize in one of their lucky wheel spinner game. Pretty convenient, huh? If you want to spin the wheel and have a chance of winning the Dragon Bone inscription, you need Golden Diva Essence. To get that, all you gotta do is beat a giant. Immortal Golden Diva. Simple, right? Is that another six-man dungeon that I will get my ass kicked in? Is this what this thing... No. It's, this is not it. Well, I'll probably do it sometime later. Oh, I didn't know. I chose over on the Howling Shrine rooftop. Over there. Just follow Bunna with your glide skill. Oh, I didn't know these young ones was his granddaughter. Wow. I thought they were just his disciple. Uh, but I don't think I have it. This. Ooh. Yeah, I don't have it. So, he did say I have to kill a giant. Oh, I'm assuming it's a boss. To get the, um, dragon bone inscription. Okay. I can do that later. Uh... You're a hallucination, aren't you? You and those nasty pink dog hawks. Wait, it's really you? You're the one who saved Yanwa from the Tinian cult. Please help me. It's so hot, I think I drank too much water. I need vitamins, no minerals, no salt, baby. I can't even think. Is it getting dark out here? No, oh, that's a different tone of voice. Alright, so... Got a rock salt near Crescent Spring. From these guys? You cannot do that right now. Are these rocks so are they monster drops or is it these things no I'm more the chances he'll just run off after I give him the rock salt. Have you got some salt? Please say yes. Here you go. Oh, my head is finally clearing. I got so lost. I almost died out there in the desert. I missed my meeting, uh, reunion with my my niece, my uh, daughter, M my daughter. You and I have told so many stories. I can't keep them straight. I want to know about the Nar. Naru Sarasva. Why would you think I have the Naru Sarasva? Wait, that's not what you were going to say, was it? You know will kick me now for sure. Fine. Here. Take it. But I only have one half of it. Yanwa has the other. Oh, why did I just tell you that? Honestly, who is Yanwa and who are you? Yanwa's the daughter of Yan Sang, the Luman syndicate boss. She'll lead one day. So she's trying to prove herself by stealing hard to find objects. But Yun Sang didn't want her to go alone. Oh, cinematic intro for someone. What 
does she look like? Well, she's she running around like. in the dirt a lot. Wears strange goggles on her head. Might be a bit of trouble to keep up with. But she's the apple of my eye. Give it back! Give it! My treasure! Princess of these young were. Well. Young Tang's oldest friend. He sent me to watch her, but I can barely keep up. She's staying at the Mirage. Please look out for her while I recover. Ooh, new gun. All right. Sixty. Wow. All right. With that alarm, you guys heard? I can't talk. Okay, with the alarms you guys just heard, I guess that's it for now. So we found out about the Princess of Thieves, Youngwa. So we just need to get one more half. And Soha's in it to help us. And eventually, Lu Sang will either kill Yonkai or I will have to kill him. But anyways, with that, I'll see you guys later.